Now, where was that? Ah! I've enabled the teleporter. One brief jump and we shall arrive in Omega's control room. How convenient. You've been here before. Of course. It was no easy task threading a path through all the skirmishes. But how could I ignore the existence of such a fascinating toy? You may trust that my preliminary examination was suitably thorough. Trust? Aye. I trust your appetite for technology. I chased down a suspect airship, and who should I find but the traitor, Sid Garland? Searching for something, Engineer? Something big? It's close, isn't it? <laughs> it's like all my name days have come at once. Of all the scouts the Empire could have sent. Take care of that brute, will you? God damn it. Can't let Nero tinker around in there by himself. I'm sorry to leave you to it, but I dare say you'll manage without me. This Claude has no idea who he's dealing with. I am Gorsetsu! Samurai of Doma, you will rue your choice of opponent this day. Temporal stasis disengaged. All systems operational. Garland? All clear on this side. It's waking up. Remarkable! 
Omega's sensors immediately detected the presence of the cocoon, even at this distance. They must have been set to scan for sources of energy exceeding certain magnitudes. I still don't see any means to control the machine directly. It seems to have been designed to act wholly autonomously. Hmm. Once we release Omega, we can be fairly certain it will attempt to capture the Primal at Belsar's Wall. Assuming its mission is successful, our only option at that point will be to re-engage its stasis system and put it back to sleep. And should the machine happen to misbehave, we'll simply initiate an emergency shutdown. I confess we don't yet have a complete grasp of its capabilities, but I'm certain the details will not elude us for long. Well, I understood less than half of that. So, my question to you is, are we doing the right thing? What do I think? All right. Step aside, Sid. Is this the thing I need to press? Uh, yes. That's the one. You gave too much for us to waste this chance, Papalimo. So this is for you. And me. Pretty! Show us what you can do! The launch sequence has begun. Omega is loose.
Huh? Omega has stopped transmitting. But that shouldn't be. I, I didn't engage the stasis system. And what does this signify? I have little understanding of these contrivances. The launch went exactly to plan, but all signals emanating from Omega have ceased. This may indicate any number of things, but we will need to join the Scions out in the field, if we are to ascertain which one. Right. I've ordered the malfunctioning beast to go to sleep. That should prevent any unfortunate mishaps. I suggest we make our way back to Gridania. Omega destroyed the cocoon. Papalimo's spell is fading. It was bound to his ether, you see. And if the connection is broken, 